What's up guys, it's Ethan here and today I'm just going to do a quick review on Doctor Strange and the Multiverse of Madness. I saw this Friday, Friday night on opening night, but I wasn't able to get around to do the review because I was pretty busy. So I'm just going to do a quick review, like what my thoughts were and my rating. Uh, so this basically takes place months after uh, Spider-Man No Way Home where... Uh, Dr. Stephen Strange just learns about the multiverse and what I could do. So he travels like to multiple, multiple different realities to try to figure out what's been going on and all. And help this kid learn about what her powers is. is. And uh, it's, nice, it's a nice little surprise that uh, Elizabeth Olsen plays one of Maximoff is the Scarlet Witch, a.k.a. the villain in the movie. Which, that surprised me, so... Yeah, this movie included a bunch of cameos that I was not expecting, which I'm not going to say all of them. But if you've seen the movie, you know what I mean. Um, uh, let me think. Uh, has some, like, horror elements, which is kind of like, this is probably, like, Marvel's first horror movie. Because, like, again, there were some horror elements to the film. Uh, yeah, so just, I thought this was, like, a pretty in Interesting movie. I think it's better than the first movie. I highly suggest you guys go see it. So again, that was just a quick little review. I'm not. I wasn't spoil, going to spoil much. So my final rank is going to be an eight out of ten. Highly enjoyed this movie, and I'll definitely watch it again. So anyway, thank you guys for watching. Comment, like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.